Scientists strongly suspect that there may be an entire new family of particles waiting to be discovered. In the theory known as supersymmetry, there are partners for every one of the known particles in the standard model. The existence of these partner particles might help solve quite a few of the outstanding mysteries in physics, including the imbalance of matter and antimatter in the universe today, the nature of dark matter, the surprisingly small mass of the Higgs boson, and the anomalous spin of the muon. The most powerful tool we have at present for hunting down supersymmetric particles is the Large Hadron Collider, or LHC, the world's largest and most powerful accelerator. The LHC smashes together beams of protons traveling at close to the speed of light, achieving combined collision energies of up to 13.6 trillion electron volts. That's equivalent to a single proton having the same kinetic energy as a fruit fly traveling at top speed. One of the two major general purpose detectors at the LHC is called ATLAS. Researchers involved with the ATLAS collaboration have recently published data from run 2 of the LHC, covering the period from 2015 to 2018. It provides the most complete summary to date of the team's efforts to track down some of the most elusive types of supersymmetric particles, those that would be produced only rarely through the weak force or the electromagnetic force. The lightest of these weakly interacting supersymmetric particles could, it's been suggested, be the source of dark matter. The increased collision energy and the higher collision rate provided by RUN2, as well as new search algorithms and machine learning techniques, have enabled a deeper exploration of a hard-to-reach realm of supersymmetry. The ATLAS team have now presented results from eight separate searches, each looking for evidence of supersymmetric particles in a different way. The combined power and sensitivity of the various search strategies has allowed the researchers to test tens of thousands of supersymmetry models, each with different predictions about the masses of supersymmetric particles. The searchers have unprecedented sensitivity and explore a wide range of supersymmetric particle masses. The ATLAS team looked for evidence of lab-formed dark matter. In other words, dark matter created transiently during LHC collisions. These efforts have proved complementary to other experiments seeking natural relic dark matter left over from the Big Bang. One of the most significant findings of this combination of searches is that some regions of supersymmetric particle masses that were previously viewed favorably where the dark matter particle has about half the mass of the Z boson or the Higgs boson, have now been almost totally ruled out. Another benefit of such a comprehensive study is an understanding of which supersymmetry models haven't yet been probed. Atlas has presented examples of such surviving models which can be used to optimize future searches. Though possible hiding places for supersymmetric particles are being systematically reduced, many models remain stubbornly elusive. Improving the sensitivity of ATLAS searches to these models will require more collision data and further ingenious developments in search strategy.